Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are just now subscribing to my channel, thank you so much for watching today's video. Today I'm doing a little mini review on Ovani's makeup brushes. So let's go ahead and get started. I got these brushes. They're 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, they're 10 brushes that I got off of eBay. I got these brushes and sorry if they're a little dirty right now because I literally just cleaned them and ended up using them at the last minute but I'll get to that in a moment but these brushes I got from eBay they were $20 and I forgot the manufacturer that sells them but they were sold out of I want to say they were sold out of North Carolina for 10 brushes these are the same manufacturers for Sigma brushes so these are good dupes for Sigma brushes if you don't want to spend that much on the actual Sigma brushes they're made out of synthetic hair as well as uh, horse hair and pony hair so they're really really soft and yeah actually I actually got a chance to wash these brushes I think my I think I washed them once since I've had them and they still retain their same um, feel that they had when I first bought them each brush came in an individual uh, slip case, plastic slip case for them for protection as well as the case itself. It came inside of a plastic case to protect it. This is really nice for a nice, I think it's a nice Christmas gift for one because the holidays are coming up. But it's also a really nice travel case if you need all the essential things for face brushes. So in this case, let me scroll. I made a list and I forgot and I don't want to take forever telling you guys what the brushes are on here but in this case we have a powder brush a top foundation brush a blush brush a foundation brush an angled foundation brush an angled shading brush a top foundation brush and by top they just mean it's like a stippling brush in case you didn't know and so top foundation brush angled contour brush a pencil brush and an eye contour brush I mostly use out of this whole case I use the pencil brush the top foundation brush or the stipple foundation brush and just the regular um, foundation brush this is really good when I'm putting on my liquid foundation or my cream foundations so it just feels so amazing when you put them on your face because it's really soft and I actually these ones are dirty because I recently like I said used them on my face today uh, I mainly use this brush even though this is a pencil brush I like to use this brush for my concealer under my eyes so this is a good brush for that and um, what else do I use this for I think I oh yeah yeah um, dark spots on my face as well I'll use this concealer for it of course I use the top foundation brush for my liquid foundation just dab it on buffer it around really good for that I also use, if depending on how I feel, I might use my angled contour, not my angled contour, my angled foundation brush just to get like those creases where my nose and my eyes meet. What else do I use in here? I haven't gotten a chance to use the contour um, top brushes, the smaller ones, or the shading brushes yet because I'm not really a fan of eyeshadow. Let's talk about washing so since these are made predominantly out of goat hair not goat hair synthetic hair and uh, ponies hair and whatnot they hold makeup more so it's going to take a little more time to clean them than with like a BH cosmetic brush not saying that there's anything wrong with that but these just they put on makeup well and they also hold makeup well so you have to wash them a couple of times to get the makeup off with washing these brushes I usually use olive oil and just like um, Dawn dish detergent mix it up together and just lather it up several times until it comes out white versus the foundation colors or whatever colors that I used on the brushes with some of the brushes I haven't experienced that much shedding with the big brushes but you can see at the top so on some of the brushes you can see that the hairs are kind of coming up a little bit they haven't come out yet but I can tell that if I wash them a couple of more times that they will start to shed 
so that might be an issue with someone but mostly this is pretty much what happens when you wash the brushes regardless of the mini hairs popping out on the big brushes I really do love these brushes I haven't experienced shedding with them yet I'm just noticing the little hairs coming up on them but all in all I love these brushes my mom and my sister has been asking for a set so I might end up getting them a set for Christmas I really want the brush set that has because I'm not into spending a lot of money on brushes and stuff because I have a bunch of brushes but I'm not into spending that much money on them I probably if I looked harder I probably could have gotten the brush set that has like 24 in a pack versus 10 or something it probably would have been a little more but if I wanted to I probably could have found one that had more brushes in it like the actual eye brushes but for now I'm happy with this I'm happy with the foundation brushes I'm happy with the texture and the maintenance and even the little case that it comes in I've had no problems with these brushes whatsoever so and I've had them for about a month now so generally I'm really happy with the way that they turned out for them to be off of eBay which I don't normally shop for things like cosmetic wise on eBay but I'm glad that I did because it was a really really good bargain and it only took I think it took about two or three days for them I'm pretty sure that they ship from North Carolina so it took them about two or three days to ship them to my home address which I was happy about because as soon as I got them I used the crap out of them so they're like my new favorite brushes I still use BH cosmetic brushes the ones that I got from Amazon but by far like for the liquid foundation that I'm using now for the Lancome that I wear now and the NARS these are the best brushes by far so I hope you guys enjoyed my review if you like Ovani brushes give me a thumbs up I will also include the link to the brushes in the description box below if anyone's interested in purchasing them if you have any comments or other reviews that you want to share about the brushes that I might not have covered feel free to put them at the bottom of the page I greatly appreciate it and I'll see you guys in my next video